He went. This is one of the most gross things, despicable verse in the scripture. He went and had himself. Praise God. He brought again the 30 pieces of silver, cast it down. Turn to two persons beside you and ask them the question, what is your price? What is your price? What is your price? And be more pointed, ask them, what is your price for Jesus? Hallelujah. Show hallelujah and take your Father, bless in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. And he went and had himself. Thank you, Jesus. The only one of the twelve that was from Galilee. He disgraced his high office. which he was appointed. He died an outlaw. An outlaw from God. I'm going to talk to you for a little while. When you look at Judas and the comments of Judas, it is always he was a thief. He cared not for the poor. The son of perdition. That is sad There was no compliment given to Judas. He carried the bag. Come on. Judas called Judas handpicked yes. by God. Yes. It was not his brother who called him and said, let me introduce you to Jesus. God by God. But Judas has displayed to us his love for money. The root of evil. Yes. Matter of fact, this man is abhorred by all men. He's considered the lowest of all criminals. The name Judas Is so bad that a man would not even name his dog a Judas. Come on, talk to me. For money, he treacherously stabbed Jesus in the back. For money, he betrayed God. For money. Amen. Come on, talk with me. Talk. For money, he was willing to send Jesus to death. Judas failed to understand that if you eat from Satan's table, 
you're going to get choked somewhere along the road. Can I talk to somebody? For money, he kissed the entrance to heaven and went to hell. For money, he hugged the way to eternal life and went to hell. For money, he kissed the doorway to heaven and chose hell. I marveled and I wondered how could Judas sat with God ate with God fellowship with God yes sir saw the splendor and the revelation of God and was untouched, unmoved. I wish I, I was in that era to have walked with Jesus. To have touched him. John said, we handle the incorruptible word. Judas touched him. Held in his hands. They were friends. He was part of the inner circle of God. Judas must have been there when Jesus said, Fill the water pots. And then he told the servant, Go draw. And when they draw from the water pot came wine that when the governor of the house tasted the wine, he said, what kind of wine is this? Judas must have been there when the lepers were cleansed. When Jesus opened the blinded eyes, when Jesus walked to Nain and stopped the funeral procession and walked over to a dead young boy and said, Arise! And the dead boy got up. He saw all of that. But Judah's focus was on money. The miracles never affected him. The signs never troubled his spirit. Money. 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 Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, is he the only sailor on this ship? No, beloved. There are still some persons here that is about to sell it. that there was a man named Naboth and the king came over to his house and said Naboth sell me a vineyard I rise up to minister to somebody today and I have got the confirmation from the song. Send me your vineyards. 
But Naboth looked at Ahab the king and said, No, it's my father's inheritance. Hallelujah. It's not for sale. Oh God, do I have a witness in this house? Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. Tell your neighbor it's not for sale. My God is my father's inheritance. Ahab said, I'll give you a better one. But the neighbor said, no. Keep the better one. It's my father's inheritance. It's not for sale. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory be to God. Somebody shall glory in this hour. Somebody shall utter not for sale. So Jude said earnestly, contend for the faith that was once delivered unto the saints. Hallelujah. Oh, good God. That's why the church today is raising up a standard of true worship in the house. Come on, brothers and sisters. There is an attack on the house, but we are victorious. Can I talk to those that are victorious for a while? I'm talking about Jesus. Hallelujah. Come on, saints of God. Jesus Christ is our captain and our commander in chief. Hallelujah. He has never lost a battle and he will never lose one. Hallelujah. When I tell you to say hallelujah, you are saying hallelujah to the one who creates the heaven and the earth. Oh, when I say, say hallelujah, you are not saying hallelujah to any man and any presiding priest. You are saying hallelujah to the one who raised the heavens in his hand. I'm talking about Jesus. He called the dust of the earth. Hallelujah. He spoke the, the consternation in place. It is the one who said, let there be. And there was. Come on, say hallelujah. My God. You just said hallelujah to the one who was there before the morning star song and the sons of God shouted for joy. Somebody say hallelujah. You just say hallelujah to the one who carries the title, the word of God. I'm talking about Jesus. Shout glory in this house. My God, my God. Hallelujah. I'm coming against the spirit of Judas in this house. Hallelujah. The devil has released a spirit in the house. But we're going to break it with the power of apostolic authority in this house. Hallelujah. No unsaved. No backslider should leave this house unless they are arrested by the power of the house. Hallelujah. Put your neighbors in power. Hallelujah. Oh, good God. Come on. Glory be to God. Come on. There is none like Jesus. Who is this Jesus? He died, but he raised himself up. Come on. He had no sin, yet he died for all our sin. I'm talking about Jesus in this house. Somebody shout hallelujah. My God. Hallelujah. Sit down a while. Good God from glory. Look at Judas here. My God. What kind of man is this? A man who lived. Amen. For over three years. In the presence of God. How can you be? In first united. When the power of God. Is 
is moving in the house and you're untouched unmoved hallelujah while others are praising God you can't praise God the devil has you on a leash Oh, my God. 
God, my God. Hallelujah. Judas, my God, is sitting there. Hallelujah. Jesus said, Judas, don't do it. My God, they sat at supper. And the Lord is saying, don't do it. Hallelujah. But the word of the Lord said that now Jesus called them to the Last Supper. And when he bid them to the Last Supper, guess where Judas found his place? Right beside Jesus. My God, my God. John on one hand, Judas the lethal enemy. On the other hand, Jesus at the height of his ministerial career sat what a last supper with his inner circle. Jesus, Judas has already conspired with the high priest and the temple policemen to sell Jesus. He already received 30 pieces of silver. That was his price for God. That was Judas's price for the creator. That was Judas's price for the I am. That was Judas's price for the Alpha and the Omega. That was Judas's price for the anointed charity. That was Judas's price for the Adam, for the anointed, for the root of David. That was Judas's price for El Elohim. That was Judas's price for Jehovah Shammah. That was Judas's price for Jehovah Tiskino. That was Judas's price. Come on! Hallelujah! Glory be to God! He sold him for 30 pieces of silver. And at the last supper, Judah took the best piece and sat beside Jesus at the last supper. Hallelujah! And the word of the Lord said that Jesus said, What thou doest, do it quick.